This weekend is Easter weekend, but there's something else going on. It's a very important one for the Hawaii Polo Club. On Sunday, they will be celebrating something very special. Joining us this morning to tell us all about it is Mark Tarone. You're the co-producer of the uh, Hawaii Polo Club. Tell us what's going on this Sunday. Uh, we have huge Sunday this week. Thank you so much for having me. Uh, we are celebrating 60 years of the Hawaii Polo Club out in Mokalia, hosting polo, hosting the community. Uh, really amazing to think that they opened their doors in 1963, and this Sunday we're kicking off our 63rd season with a huge celebration. That's a long time, 60 yeah. years. That's amazing. Uh, there, there's more the, to the event than just watching polo. What else do you have. Yeah, it's, it's really a festival out there. For one, it's it's one of the most beautiful places on the entire island. We're right on the ocean in Mokalia. Amazing views of the ocean and the coastline stretching out to Kahuku. Uh, and then we're also just at the foothills, at, at the base of the tallest mountains on Oahu. So we're right below the Waianae Mountains. And Mount Ka'ala is 5,000 feet high. That's a mile high, just a few miles away from us. So absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's tailgating around the whole field. You can bring tents, coolers, barbecues, anything you want for your tailgates. And and then we have the traditional polo with a clubhouse, with a tent, table service. We've got great food vendors, Maya's, Maya's uh, tapas from Haleiwa, and some other people are going to be out there. And then we finish it with a concert by John Cruz. Uh, his fourth time opening our season. Oh. One of my favorite Hawaii artists of all time and extremely happy for that as well. That's, that's a, That sounds like a great time. So this season is in honor of Murph Daly. Can you tell us a little bit about yeah, that? Yeah, so Murph Daly co-founded this club uh, with her husband in 1963. She's still Still with us today, 104 years old. Wow. She lives on the property. She's been living on that property, you know, since they since they opened it pretty much. And and she, you know, the rail son is the queen of Makaha. Murph Daly is the queen of Hawaii Polo. Uh, she's done it all, and she set the culture and, and given so much to the community. Uh, a polo player herself, really breaking uh, breaking barriers as a an early women's polo player, mm -hmm. uh, hosting dignitaries. She hosted Duke Hanamoku at the first match of Hawaii Polo in Mokalea. Wow. Uh, she hosted Prince Charles in 1974. Ooh, King Charles, um, huh? <laughs> yeah, yes, yes. Yeah, there we go. We got some pictures uh, when he came out. Wow. 3,000 people out there for he's that a, match. Of course, he's big on the polo. So, well, I mean, just to imagine her since her mid 40s to see it today after 60 years oh my gosh. has to be amazing for her you know she still has the spirit you know and she yeah. looks out and she sees you know we, the, we're gonna have a full house and you know the whole field is packed and, and she's just beaming it's really really beautiful how, how do you get tickets for this for this yeah so you just go to hawaiipolo.com it's super easy and um you know th with, this is the opening day of a whole season so we're hosting matches in the community every sunday through labor day so it's about 21 sundays in a row we're going to be there every single Sunday, open this weekend. And then with two types of tickets, you can get a tailgate ticket where you really literally reserve a stall on the side of the field, bring anything you want. And then we have our clubhouse tickets as well. So it's, it's your choice. And um, our actually for this weekend, we're sold out on our, our sidelines, but we have uh, lots of tickets available for, uh, for our general parking and then great picnic areas as well. Wow, sounds like a, a, a lot of fun that you're going to have. you got a lot of things. you got a lot of refreshments and uh, spirits and, and fun people. And, of course, the polo, right? Oh, what a uh, game. Yeah. It's absolutely amazing. Uh, you know, just so fast, and, and it's physical. Uh, it, even if you've never seen polo before, you're going to love it. it you right. know, you can, there's strategy, and, you know, just, you know, there's plays that they set up. But just, you know, horses racing at full speed. And, uh, and right. then, you know, they hit that ball. Like, the polo field can fit five football fields. In it. It's huge, and they're just oh, wow. racing back and forth, hundred-yard drives with you know with <laughs> the ball. It, it's, it's super fun, even if you've never seen a polo match. I can barely ride a horse, so I don't think I can <laughs> do. I'm with you. I'm <laughs> I, with can, you. I don't I just, think I can do both at the same time. <laughs> I just produce. I produce and, and make sure everybody's having a good time. Mark Mahalanui for joining it's us. Great to be here. Thank you so much. Something else to do this weekend. Thank you very much.